Praise the Lord. Today, I have entitled my messages, A Mother's Blessing. In my own words, I define the word blessing, number one, as the form of words used to invoke the good. The word blessing means to bestow a wish on someone that they can experience the favor of God. It was after the creation of a woman that God spoke a blessing upon a man and a woman. He did not speak or release a blessing on man alone. He waited until your creation, that's when he spoke a blessing. Your creation came with a blessing. You are the one that carries children in your womb, which means you carry a blessing. You as a woman, you are a carrier of a blessing. Why do I say so? The Bible in the book of James chapter 1 says, children are a perfect gift from above. A perfect gift is a sign of a blessing. Amen. And the blessing of God do not come with any imperfection. The blessings of God come with perfection. The blessings of God come with excellence. Yes, you are complaining. You are saying that, don't for Ninaka. Amen. You are complaining like that. But are you seated and just complaining? It's high time, mothers, you rose up to your feet and started speaking a blessing over your children. And you shall begin to see that child who is a problem begins to align himself, begins to align herself with the words that you speak over their lives. Negative words, child of God, have got power in them. They can either bring life or death upon someone's life. Numbers 14, 28 says, I shall do the very things I hear you say. So now listen, the Bible is not specific to say, I shall do the very good I hear you say. It's in general. If you constantly speak negative words upon your children, you are cursing those children. Amen. You are cursing your children the moment you continue speaking negative words over their lives. Negative words will keep you away from what God wants you to be. The desire for God is for you to live a life of prosperity, a life full of grace, a life of joy, a life of all these good things that we can think of. Negative words can destroy someone's life quicker than you can imagine. They can shatter someone's life quicker than you can imagine. Amen. Now listen, a blessing is never a blessing until you speak it out. Amen. Once you bless, you can't take back. Amen. I want you to understand that a curse can never replace a blessing, but a blessing can replace a curse. I don't care what has been spoken over your life. I don't care who has cursed you. I am here to tell you that in the service of today, you are receiving that blessing. In the service of today, that curse is being replaced with the blessing of God. Am I blessing somebody in this place? Let me hear loud. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank you.